Good morning, friends. This day, we will share with you what we learned from studying about nutrition. Our body is a temple of God, so we must take care of it to become healthy so we can serve God with no interruptions. Health is wealth, so to say. Early to bed and early to rise makes a man healthy, wealthy, and wise. In the name of the Father, and the Son, of the Holy Spirit, Amen. Lord, fill me with your wisdom, knowledge, and understanding. Bless our parents who work hard to support us. Give us good memory so that we might understand and remember what we are going to study now. This we pray in the, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, our Lord. Amen. Amen. And in the Father, of the Son, of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Nutrition Fruits, grains, and vegetables prepared in a simple way, free from spice and grease of all kinds, make with milk or cream the most healthful diet. Our Creator, our God, has furnished us in vegetables, grains, and foods all the elements of nutrition necessary to health and strength. Tea and coffee, fine flour bread, white bread, pickle cores, candies, condiment, and pastures fail of supporting proper nutriment. Do not eat large of salt. Avoid the use of pickles made with vinegar and spiced foods. Eat an abundance of fruits and the irritation that calls for so much drink at mealtime will largely disappear. It is a mistake to suppose that muscular strength depends on the use of animal food. The needs of the system can be better supplied and more vigorous health can be enjoyed without its use. The grains with fruits, nuts, and vegetables contain with all the nutritive properties necessary to make good blood. These elements, these elements are not so well or so fully supplied by a flesh diet. The, the liability to take disease is increased tenfold by meat eating. You see? So whether you eat or drink or whatever you do, do it all for the glory of God. 1 Corinthians chapter 10, verse 31 When you bring God into your healthy eating, it changes everything. Striving to honor Him and your food and drink, choices will bring not only a heart change, 
but it will also change your choices. Change my heart, oh God, make it ever true. Change my heart, oh God, may I be like you. You are the potter, I am the clay. Mold me and make me, this is what I pray. Change my heart, oh God. Make it ever true. Change my heart, O oh God. May I be like you. Shalom. God bless you and God bless us all. Amen.